Good morning, and welcome back to the game we play every day. I'm Faster Mish Plus, here to serve. In the last episode, we climbed into this dark, dank cave. We fought a pirate and rescued a bird. And I'm really tempting fate by moving around right now. <laughs> we also beat Roxanne and got her gym badge. The TM was astonished, and boy, were we astonished by that. Let's check out our team. We have a lot of fun stuff going on. We got Picasso, the Smeargle. That's it. You think he has good moves? Because he does. Water gun, sand attack, and astonish. We have impressive, the impressive Nidorina. Evolved in the last episode. Looking blue. Poisoning foes on contact. Shockwave, double kick, cut, and tail whip. I am constantly surprised by the mons that can learn shockwave. But... As much as it's a godsend, I still wish for Thunderbolt. We have Star We, the Star You for Star Me. Star Us. Yes, yeah, Star Us. Uh, Hardy Nature, which is neutral. High Special Attack, Shockwave, Water Gun, Rapid Spin, and Learned Recover. Uh, ultimately not as great as a potion, which or a super potion, which heals a set amount. We need Reliable Recovery. And last, Palmer, the modest Hariyama. Guts upping attack if suffering. Already a great attack stat. It's just ad adamant would have been better. Holding the quick claw to be quick. Arm thrust, vital throw, flail, and sand attack. And that's our team. Good stuff, right? Let's get out of this cave here. Alrighty then. Oh, it's a Marowak. Yeah, we screwed up catching one of these in the last episode. I have no excuses. I clicked flail with Palmer and ugh, just lost, just lost. Anyway, uh, I would have loved a Marowak. I think we, do we have the thick club? I, I feel like we grabbed a thick club. Getting thick club is like half the battle. You know, you get them, either get Marowak or you get the thick club. I gotta know, I gotta know, do we have it? No, okay. Uh, let's get out of here. Alright, so we have some cut trees to go through. There's this house. There's just nothing in that house, though. Yes, please cut it. Good. Good! And we'll talk to you. Just so you know, I've never once been bested by anyone at anything. I... <laughs> That's... <laughs> That's because you're rich. <laughs> you don't have to worry about poor people things, like suffering or gravity. <laughs> You just get to win all the time. You have people to live your life for you. Friggin' Mankey. Get out of here, Mankey. We're not doing this. Uh-uh. You're catching a shock wave. Shock wave. Star wave. Lightning from the sky. Lightning from this guy. A <laughs> critical hit feels good. <laughs> all right. Well, we're going to grab some level ups from these uh, jerks. Hopefully Picasso pulls through for us. Why is Picasso on the team still? I love him. I love Picasso. He's gonna come through for us. All right? I'm changing the narrative. I'm changing the story about Picasso. Picasso is our savior, our angel of mercy. He's like what, he's like what Plasma was, except he's not gonna get killed, ever. Yeah, see, that did nothing. Try again, Dunsparce. One of the most deserving of an evolution or anything, Mons. I mean, uh, they did... St no, no, a full restore? Why? It's so overkill. Whatever. What was I saying? Pokemon that deserved something to have done to them. Uh, Her Heracr oh, no, Heracross with this Mega... Heracross was already good, though. Heracross was fine. Pinsir. Pinsir got a great mega evolution. I mean, did Pinsir need it? I don't know. What else? What else need? What else needs something and got something? Cheapers Christmas, dude. We are really just getting beat up by Dunsparce, aren't we? This guy using Defense Curl and Rage to change our lives. Well, we're about to send you to the Shadow Realm. Catch this water gun! We need something else. <laughs> we need something other than water gun. 
Well, the good news is we'll always be able to find a double battle to at least teach Picasso something good. That's something that didn't exist in Gold Version. You know, I don't know if you guys know this. I probably illuminated a lot of you when I copied my own Pokemon's move. How many of you guys knew you could do that? Listen, I know that strat from running Fire Red and getting Sketch as a TM in replacement for something that everyone could learn. You know what it's like having Sketch that you could just teach anyone? That's any move. That's any move you can get your hands on. It was glorious. I got like Shadow Ball and I got uh, like Brick Break. I just got everything good on all my team members. It's beautiful. Confusion. Ha! Uh, I hope we find a water stone and a moonstone. Sucks that we have all these stone evolutions. Speaking of uh, special evolutions in this game, there is a uh, what is it? It's the um, trade evos, impossible evolutions. Since this isn't, I don't have any friends. I can't trade a macho uh, machoke to be a machamp or a, or a haunter to become a Gengar. I can't do it. Um. In Elegant Emerald, they changed it, so there are special places where if you level up like a Machoke, it'll evolve into Machamp. That's how we get those. I learned that the hard way, by the way. I didn't read the documentation for this, this kind of uh, upgrade of Emerald, and I was like, why don't I have a Machoke? I ticked Impossible Evos in, in the thing. There's a little thing in uh, the randomizer. It lets you switch them to add impossible evos, and I clicked it, and then Machoke would not evolve. And Long story short, this is a great, this is a great version of the game, because it does everything for you. And we're about to take out Oddish and Catabra. Oh, you guys are, you guys are screwed. You got nothing. We're about to shockwave, double shockwave. Hope this takes him out, that, that Catabra, yeah, okay. Wow, okay. Okay. Kinesis. They all know friggin' Kinesis, dude. Hate that. Hate that crap. Oh, doesn't matter, though. We're using Shockwave. Catch it. Catch it with your mouth. Any of you ever been electrocuted in the mouth? I'm asking for a friend. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Sweet scent. You could have gone Absorb on Starwee, but you clicked Sweet Scent. I hope you feel good about yourself, because that's the last thing you're doing. Shockwave and cut. Perfect. Yeah, I know, not very effective. But what star are we going to do? Star we. Star me. Star you. Star us. Star. Ugh, that did nothing. I'm just glad we have cut. You know, cut is not a... Uh, it isn't a vital TM or HM to beat this game. So... If I don't have a Cutmon, that's it. I don't get to catch one. I don't get to do any claws like that. I just skip a whole bunch of items. It's going to be the same way with Fly. If we don't get a Mon that can fly, we don't get Fly. <laughs> now I'm going to spend half the episode speeding up. Slacked off in school. I feel you, bro. Let me tell you about high school for me. Uh, let me tell you about middle school for me. <laughs> As soon as I left elementary school, I started playing around with a little thing called sleeping in class. Oh my goodness, let me tell you. <laughs> I'd just stay up late. I'd just stay up late and then sleep in class. Could not motivate me for crap. I was a terrible, terrible student. Kids, don't be like me. Don't be like Master Fish Plus. Let's, let's, let's speed up and grab these berries real quick. Chesto berries, we need those. I don't know if pineapple berries do anything for us, do they? I feel like I've never used a pineapple berry outside of Pokemon Go. In Pokemon Go, pineapple berries double... Yeah, alright. They double the amount of candy you get, which means more powerful Lermans. What's this? Oh, it's ladies! I'm still sore about Diglett. Still sore about that Mewtwo on Diglett. That was just brutal. No one deserves that. Critical hit confusion from Mewtwo. It's a, it's a freaking act of God right there. That's a, yeah, you need to die. That's, you're no longer going to be in this world. Oh, great. Oh, how did it go? The Devon goods. You did. You got them back. 
You really are a great trainer. I know. As my thanks, I'll give you another great ball. Mm. Give me a master ball, dude. Why, why isn't that not randomized? Excuse me, please. Come with me. This guy's getting more and more affluent. Mm, this is the Devon Corporation's third floor. Our president's office is on this floor. Anyway, I can't tell you how much I'm grateful for what you've done. Um, by the way, that parcel you got back for us. Could I get you to deliver that to the shipyard in Slateport? It would be awful if those robbers tried to take it again. Uh, he 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 he. <laughs> So, uh, could I count on you to do that for me? Oh, that's right. Could you wait here a second? Jeez. You laugh in that voice and it sounds like a horse. Our president would like to have a word with you. Mm, please come with me. Alright, green suit. Please go ahead. I'm Mr. Stone, the president of the Devon Corporation. I just got word about you. You saved our staff not just once, but twice. I have a favor to ask of an amazing person like you. I understand that you're delivering a package to Slateport Shipyard. Well, on the way, could you stop off in Duford Town? I was hoping that you'd deliver a letter to Stephen in Duford. I'm not your errand boy, old man. Now, you should know that I am a great president. So I'd never be so cheap as to ask a favor for nothing in return. That's why I want you to have this. Great, a map. That device. It's a Pokemon Navigator, or Pokenav for short. It's an indispensable tool for any trainer on an adventure. It has a map of the Hoenn region. You can check out the locations of Duford and Slateport easily. By the way, I've heard that sinister criminals, Magma and Aqua, I believe, have been making trouble far and wide. I think it would be best if you rested up before you went on your way. Thanks, dude. Well then, fish, go with caution and take care. Great. He's gonna call me as soon as I leave and be like, You're poking out as a phone. Now we can track you. We're gonna listen in on your phone and give you advertisements. Um, I've been developing an added feature for the Pokenav, and it turned out great. Fish, may I see that Pokenav, the one our president gave to you? There you go, Fish. I added a new feature named Match Call to your Pokenav. Using the Match Call feature, you can chat with people who have been registered in your Pokenav. Fish, our President Stone should be registered in your Pokenav. Test it out. Please give our president a call. Uh, sure, whatever you did. Whatever you say, dude. Brand new features, Emerald Virgin. Oh, Fish, since you called me, the Pokenab must be working properly. I'm a great president. Other people will be registered, so I'm pretty cool. Good, good. You seem to be quite, quite happy, but not as happy as me because I'm rich. How could I know that? I'm staring at you. Ha, 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 ha. I'll be watching. All right. Um, I'd better get back to work. Please take care, Fish. Yeah, whatever, dude. I'm not enthused. Those guys rub me the wrong way. They're all up in their high tower with their Groudons and their Jirachis and their Ho-Ohs thinking, what a loser. We're sending him out to a cave. Ho <laughs> ho. He's giving me EXP share for all this. I'm telling you. But you should give me Lucky Egg. That's what I really want. That's where the money is. Uh-oh. We're going to fight May. I have a buddy who won't let me live it down if I don't fight her. Oh, uh, like, hi, Fish. You had a match call feature put on your Pokenab. Let's register each other so we can contact one another anytime. Great. Oh, by the way, I passed Mr. Briny in Petalburg. I guess he's on his way home to his cottage by the sea. How's your Pokedex coming along? Fish, mine's looking pretty decent. So how about a little battle? You just became a trainer, Fish. I'm not going to lose. Yes, you are. Because if I lose to you, I lose the lock. And then everybody laughs at me. I lose all my subscribers. And I die. <laughs> you heard it here, folks. <laughs> if I lose the lock, I lose my life. If you die in the game, you die for real. Get, get the, uh, well, you know, that's not the worst thing. Because now all these arm thrusts are about to hit even harder. You gotta be kidding me. You gotta be kidding me, Palmer. Oh, no. Hey. Remember fun? We're not doing that anymore. Remember when we enjoyed Pokemon? Nah! 
all in the past. Come on. Mercy. What? Yes! That is money. That is EXP as well. 498. Yes, please. Who else? Pidgeotto? We have a mon for Pidgeotto, and it is Star Us. It is Star Platinum. That's what I should have called Star You. <laughs> All right. All right, enough of that. Let's get a shockwave. I'm faster? Nice. I'll take that. I got to look up where water... Can you buy Waterstone? If you can buy Waterstone, it's not to Lily Cove. I know that. So where is Waterstone? Ooh, that hurt. We're going to need that Waterstone fast or we're in trouble. Nice. At the very least, we can get it for now, but you know, come like level 30, we're going to be hurting. Yikes, you're better than I expected. 10, 20. It's money. Oh, by the way, Mr. Briny, who I just passed... Uh, excuse me. Fish, you just moved here, so you might not... <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> so you might not know this, but Mr. Briny was once a revered seeker. Thanks. No, I'm... Gosh, get in the door! Get in the door, me. I don't have time for this. I do, but don't tell anybody. All right. Got a couple items we can scoop. Let's make sure we get them. Master Ball. Show me a Master Ball. I can't tell you how many times. Ooh, Shell Bell. That is perfect. We want that. Uh, we want Shell Bell on Palmer. And then we can put Quick Claw on another Slowmon. Perfect. All right. We did this already, right? Crap. I got to check now. I got to know. Lord Helix. See ya. Did we do it? Yeah, we did it. Okay, we're good. All right, let's go over here. And then this is honestly, when I get Master Balls, they're in here. I don't know why, but I feel like it's happened more than once. Sneasel, we could add Sneasel. Oh, shoot. Fake Out. All right, dude, let's learn Fake Out. Uh... And we don't, we don't need Flail. Especially over Fake Out. You know, Fake Out has utility. Flail is just normal type vital throw with HP specific damage. Uh, let's put some levels on Impressive. Impressive's gonna be a heavy hitter for as long as she's alive. I'm gonna keep Impressive alive as long as possible. Thank you. But uh, sometimes things happen. If we got another Mewtwo that feels like throwing a crit at us, goodbye, Impressive. That's it. That's, uh, that's all she wrote. I'm just glad we have her, though. We got a Moonstone. Needle Queen's great. Needle Queen is a great mod. Poison Ground. That's some good typing, especially with the split in this game. I mean, even without the split, those stabs are both physical. So it ends up being good all around. Ganlon Berry. <sighs> I love it. I love the berries. I just I can't get enough of them. Sacred Ash. I mean, that's rare. That's a rare item. I I can't dispute. Fan pee. Oh, it's a Levant. I would love a fan pee. I have impressive though, and that's impressive on its own. <laughs> All right, come on, no encounter. Good. All right, so. Uh. Welcome back to Encounter City. Da, 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 da. Hold on, lass. Wait up, Pico. Your fish, you say, my darling bird. We owe so much to you. What's that? You want to sail with me on the wide open blue sea? Oh, you have a letter bound for two four and a package for Slayport. Then I'm just, I'm just your man with a boat. Quite the busy life you must lead. But certainly, what you're asking is no problem at all. You've come to the right man. We'll set sail for Duford. Duper it is then. Anchors away. We're setting sail. Yeah, yeah. Now I gotta listen to stories, right? Oh, shoot. What was my dad's voice? Oh, I love the voice. What was it? Uh, I cannot remember it. Oh, fish. Where are you now? 
It sounds windy wherever you are. I just heard from Devon's Mr. Stone about your poking app, so I decided to give you a call. It sounds like you're doing fine, so that's fine with me. You take care now. Bye-bye. I'm gonna have to look that up. I remember loving the voice I did for him. All right, let's end this. Good. All right, we're here. Oh, wait, we have Atlanta and Duford. Oh, blah, blah, blah. I'm off to see ya. <laughs> Mr. Briny's a great dude. Okay, we're good on heal. We're good on heal. All right, so... We're entering Encounter City. Yeah, I want to fish, dude. Give me, give me, give me your rod. Yeah, yeah, I know how to do it. I just want to get to it. All right, we have like one, two, three, four, five, six encounters right now. So we're gonna do all of them in ten minutes, maybe, probably not. Sound good? Great. Uh, let's get everyone in order. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. All right, here we go. Six encounters coming up. The entire team is going to change. Oh, a bite! What is it? So in this game, all the encounters are going to be different. It's Meditite! Uh, it's not going to be Meditite everywhere. It's different in this game. Fortunately. Let's do a rapid spin, please. Hopefully this doesn't take him out. Okay, good. It did nothing. I would love a Metatite. Metatite has my back. I mean, look at him. He's all like, oh! He's an onion head. He's singing to us. He's a fighting psychic mon. He's the counterpart to Hariyama. I think. Yeah, quit getting that attack up. I don't like that. Don't crit. Good. And he uses bide. Perfect. That's exactly what we want. So he's just going to sit there until we get him. Perfect. Meditite. Yes, please. Yes. Oh. Oh, come on, onion boy. Come on. Come on, sir. Get in the ball. Get in the multicolor ball. There we go. What do we call him? I don't have a nickname for Meditite. Oh, I know. It continually meditates, meditates for hours every day. As a result of rigorous and dedicated yoga training, it has tempered its spiritual power so much it can fly. So much it can fly? Yo! I didn't know that. Oops, I want this. It's Onion Boy. Onion Boy? <laughs> what you doing, Onion Boy? I'm practicing yoga. It's very serious. All right, Onion Boy. You take care. Oh, it's Gorbis. Almost said that wrong. This is not going to be easy to catch. But here's a fun fact for you. Gorbis has no reason to be as tough as it is. I have consistently seen some dangerous stuff come out of Gorbis, and you wouldn't expect it. Same thing with Huntail. Same thing with Huntail. Although that could be skewed because the last Gorbis and Huntail I ran into that gave me grief were in Pokemon Reborn. And as you'll find out someday very soon, Pokemon Reborn, <laughs> it's like, it's like being a, a, a world, a world-class bodybuilder. I should use water gun. Crap, this is gonna kill it. Ah, dang it. Ah, I didn't think. I wanted to tell my story. Now we don't have a story or a Gorbis. I gotta get on with these encounters, man. I am sucking. I am sucking wind on these. Well, let's check out Onion Boy. Pure power going on the team. That's it. That's what I want to see. Pure Power Meditite, oh baby, Pure Power Meditite. I love it, Route 106, you can't give me anything better. What do you have? Not even a nibble. There's nothing out here. All Pokemon have gone extinct. I'm sorry, I got really charged. <laughs> I got really charged up from that. It's all right. It's a Clefable, awesome. 
Clip Babel, she's from the last game. She didn't get a chance to shine, but I guarantee if we catch her, she's going on the team. Unless we get something better. How did you metronome sing? Of all 500,000 moves, the most annoying one. And Sing has like 60 accuracy, dude. If you click self-destruct. Ah, uh, wonderful. You have a lot of HP. Huh. Wait, no, they, no, 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 no. She metronomed Sing, right? She didn't use it. That was a metro, that was a metronome. I'm not crazy. I'm not seeing things. Star, we wake up. Thank you. <sighs> Getting flustered in this episode. All right, fine. I don't care anymore. You can do what you want. Sing, don't sing. Write a platinum album. Do it. Live your best life, hon. Get out there. Curl that tail. Be a be a uh, a winner. Be the thing that Gengar is the shadow of. You know, that would make sense if Clefable didn't come from space and Gengar wasn't based on dead people. Yeah, it would make sense. Stay in the ball. Hey, Collegend joins the team. You a Clefable? Nah, you a Collegend. 4'3", 88 pounds. Uses its wings to skip lightly as if it were flying. Its bouncy step lets it walk on water. On quiet, moonlit nights, it strolls on lakes. That's pretty cool, Collegend. Ka... Dang it, Ka... Ka... Collegend. Don't fail me now, words. Collegend. Perfect. That's what we wanted the entire time. Show me pure power, Clefairy. Cute charm, gentle nature. Ooh. I'm pretty sure that is special defense. Could be wrong. Could be wrong. And you know what? Uh, that's awesome. But check this out. I know a little secret that nobody else in the entire world knows. Gold your eyes on this beauty. It's a silk scarf. It's right at the cutting edge of fashion. Oh, I can see your eyes twinkling. You appreciate my dazzling style. Oh, you're a delight. Here you go. I want you to have it. Thanks, dude. <laughs> Thanks, cutting edge of fashion. We can put that on a normal type and Gotta be careful. I don't want that man to see me. I want to cut right through. Grab this. Sharp beak. Number two. And, and, energy root. <laughs> energy. Oh, get hyped, guys. It's energy root. All right, let's go grab Flash. Oh, it's our encounter. What is it? Move that bus. Nuzleaf. All right. I am, I'm all right with Nuzleaf. Uh, that is, that'll be, we need a grass stone for Nuzleaf. All right. We didn't need it. We didn't need any of that. Hey, you. It gets awfully dark ahead. It'll be tough trying to explore. That guy who came by earlier, Steven, I think it was, he knew how to use Flash, so he ought to be all right. But, well, for us hikers, helping those that we meet out is our motto. Here you go. I'll pass this on to you. Helping out people, huh? That's news. You always try to fight me. Teach that hidden move Flash to a Pokemon and use it. It lights up even the inky darkness of caves. But to use it, you need the gym badge from Doofer's Pokemon Gym. Really? You're gonna try and stop me with Flash, huh? Trying to keep me down? Not gonna happen, bro. Alright, let's check out our stuff. So we got these two. Uh, we still have... Two more encounters. One in Petalburg and then one on Route 115. We also have to grab the experience share, which can only be done after we deliver the letter. So, in the next episode, we will go deliver the letter to Steven, get the EXP share, get our other two encounters, and then maybe clear out the gym. I want to thank you so much for watching this episode, for putting up with me. <laughs> Please like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoyed. Ring the bell for notifications, and I hope to see you in the next one. Farewell! <laughs>